You know, school districts are making it a lot easier for their teachers and employees right now to get the new coronavirus vaccine. Yeah, Jared. thousands, Nicole, expected to get their first shots here in the next couple of days. Carissa Planel takes us to Mesa, where that process started today. Mesa Public Schools expects to administer 4,000 doses of the Moderna vaccine over the next few days. The vaccination events are kicking off today here at Westwood High School. The vaccine is optional for employees, but some teachers say they couldn't wait to get the shot. I feel um, a bit of relief and I feel hope going forward and I would just like to see this no. go away. Lynn Merrill Aiken no. teaches in the Growing Up Successfully program. She wants to see a day where schools are back to normal. As difficult as it may have been for teachers, I think it's much more difficult on the families that are involved. When Lynn got the alert yesterday about the opportunity to get vaccinated, she immediately signed up. We know that um, we have a community that would like to see our schools open. And in order to do that, we need to have a healthy and safe staff. Superintendent Dr. Andy Forless says most schools in the district are back in person. Both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines have been approved for older teens, but Forless says there has not been any discussion on requiring the vaccine for staff or for students. I believe that's a, par uh, a parent's decision. State Rep John Fillmore has introduced a bill that allows parents to pull their kids out of school if there's any kind of outbreak rather than vaccinate them against the disease. This is not an anti-vaccination bill by any means. It's a personal freedom bill. Fillmore says schools would then have to work with families to help unvaccinated students continue learning at home. Lynn says she's just grateful to have the COVID-19 protection. I would feel better with a vaccine than wondering if I'm going to get coronavirus, but it has to be a personal decision. In Mesa, Carissa Planelp for Arizona's Family.